scientists have found the specific stem cells responsible for growing tooth roots and bone, and this could one day help people regrow lost teeth and the bone that supports them. A team led by researchers from the Institute of Science Tokyo, along with international collaborators, has identified two distinct types of stem cells in developing teeth, one that forms the roots and another that builds the surrounding bone. Using genetically modified mice and advanced imaging techniques, the scientists tracked how these cells develop and specialize over time. Their goal was to understand how the body naturally forms tooth roots and the jawbone so that these processes could eventually be recreated through regenerative treatments. The first stem cell group comes from a soft tissue area at the tip of growing tooth roots, known as the apical papilla. These cells produce a signaling protein called CXL12, which helps guide them into becoming various cell types involved in tooth and bone formation, like odontoblasts, which build dentin, cementoblasts, which form the outer layer of the root, and even osteoblasts, which create bone. The second group of stem cells comes from the dental follicle, the tissue sac around developing teeth. These cells produce a protein known as PTHRP and have the potential to become several important cell types. The researchers found that to grow bone cells, a signal called hedgehog has to be switched off. This on-off switch seems to be special to how the bone around teeth is made. Researchers hope to one day trigger similar regenerative processes in adults, potentially replacing artificial implants and dentures with biologically grown teeth.